Well, hello, and welcome to Vloon Day 25. You don't need to adjust your screens. I'm wearing the same thing as yesterday, but I did wash it, and I did shower, so it's exciting. Today, I'm actually gonna get up on there and start painting. I really am today, I promise you. I just underestimated the time it would take to do all the things yesterday. Anyway, I'm gonna get going with that. I will give you guys some updates. And um, yeah, we're just gonna keep it going. Doesn't it look nice back there? All the white. <laughs> Looks so pretty. Um, that stuff needs at least one more coat. And um, I'm gonna get started up there today. So we'll get this done. So it's been about an hour or so, and I painted the rails up there, or not the rails, but like the bottom part. And then I kind of touched up the rails a little bit. Painted that little section and then my, this is my mom's idea, but somehow I'm doing it for right now, but we'll figure this out. Hey! Um, but anyway, my mom wanted to paint these, so I taped up everything, which was kind of a pain in the butt, by the way. Um, and then I killed it once. So, um, yeah, now we just have to wait for it to dry. So I think I might actually go grab some lunch and then come back with some lunchage. Um, because right now I'm kind of at a standstill waiting for stuff to dry. This stuff might be dry up here, but I don't know. I'd rather rather wait because, um, you know, with paint, you want to make sure that all the layers are dry before you start the next layer. So anyway, let's see what mom's been up to. Well, I put a glassy coat on handrail mm -hmm. and a handrail over there. Yep. So that's setting up. Sweet. Put another coat on the headboard here. Yeah, it looks better. So probably need another one. It but will need another one, yes. But it looks so nice. Mm -hmm. This was like dark chocolate brown before you guys. If you haven't seen what it looked like before, um, I'll leave a link to my vlog playlist or like the Vloon playlist down below if you guys want to check it out. Cause yeah, it was pretty epically <laughs> really, really dark, almost yeah. black, but it was a dark, dark chocolate brown. So um, I love the way that this has turned out. I think it looks really nice. All right, another update. We've had lunch. It was delicious. We went to Culver's. And I have done the second coat on the exterior as much as I possibly can. Um, it's hard to see, but I can't. I couldn't get all the way to the top because this ladder is tall, but it isn't that tall. And there's like a little bit of a like fear factor situation because I'm like pretty much afraid of heights. I did as good as I could, but I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come up there and help the mama out, and then kind of hang my head over and do that because she doesn't want to do that. Let me show you the progress. Oh, and while I was at lunch grabbing stuff, mom did a second coat on here as well as did the shiny on the banister. So that looks good. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna go upstairs because there's lots of wet paint happening. Don't touch anything. Yeah, yeah, don't touch anything. So I just painted this. It's very, very high gloss shine. You can see it is still wet. <laughs> um, it's not gonna stay high gloss shine. It'll, it'll go into an eggshell, but um, this is the, the good first coat of the permanent paint. Got anything good to report, mother? Mm, I'm getting paint on me again today, but it's gonna wash out this time. Yeah, and I've got paint and lots of other paints. I actually, funny story, I actually got a little tiny, tiny, tiny piece of paint like in my eye earlier. Oh, you can still see I have some paint here. It like splashed back and got like directly in my eye. That was interesting. Burned really bad. And it was kills. It wasn't even like the regular paint. It was kills. <laughs> so don't recommend it. I don't recommend it. All right, well, I am gonna come back upstairs and help out the mama, and we'll check in soon. We'll do some stuff. So, I figured now would be a good check-in time. We're kind of at a little bit of a standstill, but, you know, we're finding more things to do. Everything is now second coated. That's all the railings, that little landing thing, the railings over here, all of this stuff. Actually, the headboard is third coated. I just painted this again, so we'll see once it dries if it needs a fourth coat. It might, because like I said, it was just so dark. Um, so it might need a fourth coat, and that's okay if it does. But anyway, let's go check on mom, see what she's up to. Dun, 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 dun. What you doing, mom? Well, I'm painting these drawer frames so that they don't stick out like a sore thrum. <laughs> 
This is what she wanted to do so bad. <laughs> and I, I killed it before I left for, um, for lunch. And then now this is the first coat of all of the, the good Benjamin Moore paint. Uh oh, all gone. Where, where, where'd all the paint go? <laughs> it's all gone. Uh oh. I have a question for all the uh, YouTube viewers out there. So I am having a real challenge. So this. If you're on the outside, literally looks right in to here. So I'm having a challenge with like the privacy of it. Do you guys have a suggestion on like a window treatment or something? Like I don't wanna put something like right in front of it because let me give you like a weird layout. So I am now completely standing at my access for the garage. So you walk in here, but there is no light switch on either side. You have to go over there to get the light switch, which is like electrically stupid. All right. So my yeah. issue is I don't want to put like a coat rack or something in there because yeah. I have like all these things. And this is six and a quarter inches across. Okay, so six and a quarter inch of total across for the window, but there is a little bit of space, but it's metal. That's the issue. Um, I tried looking for, no, no, this is metal. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, don't touch it. Don't touch it. It's don't touch the whip. <laughs> so the issue is um, I looked for metal things at the hardware store, but the only one I could find was like 12 inches or, or larger. It's just too big. So I don't know if you guys have suggestions, let me know in the comments. I'd really appreciate it. Or if you guys have like a funny window like this, let me know. Um, even like the smallest tension rod like won't fit because it's not like thick enough. I don't, it's, uh, it's just weird. So I don't know what to do about it. Let me know if you guys have any comments. Like I said, I don't want to put something in front of it because again, I need to have access to the light switches like on a daily basis. So uh, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. I would really appreciate it. And then also if you want to um, just link stuff if you want, like obviously like from Amazon or I don't know, wherever, just link stuff that maybe you guys would suggest or maybe you guys have in your home too. So um, anyway, I don't know what to do. Favorite mama is up there painting still, but we are on the third coat. Yay. You can tell by the colors of my hands. <laughs> um, all right, so I wanted to show you guys. I'm not gonna get up on the ladder with the camera because I'm a little afraid, but let me zoom you guys in. All right, so we're on the third coat. and to the left is third coated and to the right is only second coated. So I'm hoping that comes off on camera. Um, it's looking really, really nice and really, really clean. So I'm excited. There are a little bit of touch-ups that I have to take care of because obviously I was up there looking at it and all that, but that's okay. Well, we're gonna take care of some of these touch-ups that need to happen over the next couple of days. But anyway, I'm loving the way it's turning out. This is all done except for the top handle rail. That is gonna get done in a glossy finish because um, the painter that I worked with before said that that actually wears a little bit better than just the regular eggshell. So that is what I'm using for that. But my mom is actually gonna paint that I think tomorrow um, because she has the handrail that I removed. Um, another coat of the glossy on that. Sorry, the lighting's just like crazy. It's like six o'clock or no, five o'clock right now. So. Anyway, just wanted to show you the progress, but once we're done with this third coat, then we are done for the day. Okay, so we're heading home now, or to my parents' home, I should say. But the white railings, all the white railings is pretty much done. We're like 80% of the way there. So tomorrow, mom, who's getting in the car right now, um, she is going to do the glossy coat on the handrails and um, pull most of the tape. There's some of the tape that I need to get because it's like up really high in the kitchen there. And then um, I need to get on top of that like landing thing. It was still a little bit tacky, so I wanted to give it some more time to dry. And I will do that on Tuesday because tomorrow we are going to see my favorite brother. And are you excited about seeing the favorite mm. brother? Yeah, it'll be good to see him. I saw him a few weeks ago, but it'd be good to see him again. Very true, very true. But anyway, um, I think I'm gonna end out the vlog here because, oh no, I can't end the vlog here because freaking Doyle challenge. Okay, hold on. We're gonna go home, see the dog, and then I'll end it out. Doyle challenge. 
has been had. Hey, Doyle, get back over here. Come on, the people wanna see you. They like you. They probably like you more than me sometimes. Come on. Ooh, it's a Doyle dog. Doing those Doyle dog things. I just let him out of his kennel, so he's like really amped up. Like really excited about life. Um, but anyway, I'm gonna end out the vlog here. Um, we are gonna have something for dinner. I don't know what. Honestly, I'd be fine with like a little bit of popcorn and like done, you know what I'm saying? Um, but I filmed my plan with me this morning. I got the footage in my computer, but I haven't started editing. So I need to do that before I go to bed. And it's like really late. It's like seven something, like almost eight. So Ugh, it's just been intense. There was a lot of progress made, which I'm very excited about. Hopefully, I posted this on Instagram today. Hopefully next weekend I will be moving. But right now I'm really at the mercy of the flooring company and they will be out on Wednesday. And then Wednesday night I'll pop over there and um, they'll be able to tell me what day they'll be done because I don't know. They wanted to schedule five total days. I think I've said this like a couple of times in the vlog. They wanted to schedule five total working days. Um, so, but they thought they could get it done in three. So once they have their first day in there, they'll know. So hopefully it should be fairly easy install and um, we should be good to go. But anyways, I'm in a jet for now. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will put the uh, Vloon playlist down below. Do you guys like my painty hands? I can be a hand model too, look. But I'll put that playlist down below for you guys. Um, hope you guys are having a wonderful day and I will see you for tomorrow's balloon. So make sure to subscribe, like, comment, share, do all those things those YouTubers tell you to do. Um, but I will see you tomorrow. Bye guys.